To address these issues and many more, Mr. President, a very popular lifestyle vlogger from YouTube, Ingrid Nielsen. Hey, Hi, Mr. President. how are you, Ingrid? I'm wonderful. Good to see you. Great to see you. Welcome Thanks. to my living room. It is, it is <laughs> very stylish. Ever since I started running for office, people started handing me things when I'd like speak to a crowd as like, well, uh, lucky charms or keepsakes or things that uh, meant something to them. And so now I have a habit of I always carry around, and I have a whole bowl full of them, and I don't, I can't carry all of them around because then it, <laughs> they'd be, but you know, I'll, t I'll pick out a few things uh, that I just stick in my pocket to remind me of all the people I've met along the way and, and, and the stories they told me. So, the, uh, so I'll just give you, this is what I had in my pocket today. Uh, I've got, this is, this is uh, rosary beads that uh, Pope Francis gave me. Uh, that, I, that obviously uh, means a lot to me because I, I so admire him and it makes me think about you know, peace and uh, you know, promoting understanding and ethical behavior. Um, this is a little Buddha that a, oh my uh, gosh. That, uh, a Buddhist monk gave me. Wow. Uh, this is a lucky poker chip that's metal. Oh wow, that's really cool. That uh, this biker gave me. <laughs> he was like bald and he had like a big uh, handlebar mustache and a bunch of tats. And this is when I was in Iowa in 2007. So he said, this is my leg of post chip, you can have it. And then I got, this is, this is a Hindu uh, little statuette of uh, the monkey god Hanuman that uh, a woman gave me. And I've got a Coptic cross. This is from Ethiopia. Wow. So I've got a whole bunch of yes. this stuff. But these, the reason I thought it was useful to show these because I carry them, these around all the time. And it's, I'm not that superstitious. So it's, you know, it's not like I think necessarily I have to have them on me at all times. Um, but it does remind me of all the different people that I've met along the way. And, uh, how much they've invested in me and you know their stories and what their hopes and dreams are so that if I feel tired or I feel discouraged sometimes uh, I can kind of reach into my pocket and I say yeah that's something uh, you know that's something I can overcome because somebody uh, gave me this privilege to work on these issues that are going to affect them I, I better get back to work